this season so far, but they have for Nicky Kabamba as well, 17 in the league. He's going to be important tonight. Definitely. I could definitely see him getting on the score sheet tonight um, alongside um, Callum Stead, who, when I was last up here, I, I had odds. I, I put him up there to, to score, and he ended up uh, coming good for me. So I think Nicky and Callum uh, to score today, definitely, for sure. There you go, uh, Nicky and Callum to score for Barnet. That is Danny Collins' top tip. Of course, Danny's been there amongst the goals as well. Seven in total this season for you, uh, Danny. It's uh, been quite prolific for you live on National League TV this evening. There is one other game as well, AFC filed against Hartlepool. We'll keep you up to speed with that. That kicked off at the same time as well. There is Kabamba. He's just popped it down. It's gone straight to the keeper though. No worries there for Elliot Justin. Yeah, a great addition. It's a cracking facility down here at the Hive as well. The, the stand that we've got off to our left where the away supporters are, the Daggers fans. Uh, so just we'll come back to that very shortly because uh, F. Young is prowling in the box at the minute. It's going to manage to keep it in as well. It's going to run through though. It's dealt with, but it comes back into the box and somehow a Barnett's play manages to get it cleared. So he's a pivotal player for us. It's cut out though that time. It was Stevens with the loose pass, switching it over to the left. Josh Rees is streaming into the box for Dagger Ebridge. Effie Young with it, gets it Rees, comfortably into the hands though with Josh Keeley. In comes the corner. Oh, it's headed. Oh, it comes down into the goal, it's gone in somehow, it's managed to find its way in. Just trying to see who's wheeling away, is it? Josh Rees wheeling away, the Dagger and Ebridge fans are absolutely delighted. Uh, Danny, what do you make of that? Another set piece which we've conceded from, so it's, it's, it's a hard one to take. 27-year-old, it's his second spell at Dangar Redbridge for Sam Link. And it comes. It's away by Akeem, I believe. He's Pritchard, only goes as far as Sam Link. Pritchard got the deflection on it, still in. Here's Remy, he's got bodies in the box. Remy feeds it through into Sam Ling. It's on his foot, oh, it comes in. Here's Sam Ling again. Oh. Well, the ball's in a bit of no man's land and almost a bit of panic there, but the danger still not cleared by Barnett. Dagarevich coming away with it, still inside the box. Cut off the crossbar. Still not clear. Sam Ling with a little chip in. Surely Keeley's going to get it in his hands this time. Kabamba wants it. Finley Potter's in there as well. He's come forward. Ryan Hill's forward for Danker Everett should anything break, but it comes in. It's just gone over, just nodded over. There's your goal scorer, Josh Rees, knocking it back. There's going to be one minute added time in this game. It was only real one tackle in the game. Finley Potter with the foul. And no yellow card for him. That came early on. And now, what can Barnett do here? Can they break? Nicky Kabamba's in the box. Ben Coker's trotting in. So is Reese Hill Johnson and Pritchard's in. They're waiting for something. Can they get themselves level just before the break? In it comes. It's a lovely ball. It's Kabamba! Oh Nicky Kabamba! Who else? Who else is it going to be? But that man, Kabamba, with his 18th of the season. Danny. Brilliant, finally. A bit of, bit of brilliance for, from Maguire G on the, over on the right hand side. So Dean Brennan showed his hand early on. Zach Brunt coming on for Pritchard. I wonder if Pritchard took a knock or something in that first half. Here's Jake Hessenthaler. He's the son of Andy Hessenthaler. Of course, uh, I believe he's director of football at Gillingham at the minute, Andy Hessenthaler. Here's Ryan Hill working his way into the box for Dango Redbridge. The ball comes in. Oh, it's whipping around. Wonderful effort from Hill. Oh, lovely bit of skill by Finley Potter. The man alone from Sheffield United just had his line stint extended as well. And here's Hall Johnson running his way into the box. The cross comes in. Whipped across the face of goal. Oh, needed. One is my Twitter handle. Uh, I have posted about this game on my Twitter feed. So, or X feed, or whatever you want to call it these days. If you know the answer, just pop it in the comments. The ball comes in. Oh, it's punched away by Justin. Only as far as Zach Brandt. He's only come on at a break. And Zach Brandt fires Martin into the lead. An absolute thunderbolt from the number 33. And it's Zach Brunt with it. Danny. What did I say? I said if Zach Brunt has anything to play in this game, he'll definitely 
be involved when he comes on. Brilliant finish. To break here, Reese Hold Johnson. He's got Maguire Drew in front of him. He's got Callum Stead and Kabamba. Here's Maguire Drew. Oh, almost trickled in. It was almost an own goal. Now Barnett looking to break. Here is Callum Stead. Oh, he's found Nicky Kabamba. Oh, Lionswood flag has gone up. Must have been tight at Danny, very tight. I didn't get a good look at it, but Brunt was quick to say it was, came off his body. Oh, lovely play by Pia Forson, driving himself forward. And Well, if that isn't a booking, then <laughs> nothing's ever going to be a yellow card, surely there. But Finley Potter is going to find himself in a book, dragged him back. Can't really argue that one. Box absolutely flooded. Every single outfield player for Barnett inside the box, but confident goalkeeper for Josh Keeley to come out and punch it clear. Here's Vincent though for Dagger and Redbridge. Comes off Hartigan out for a Dagger's corner. It's a good corner in, but Keeley confident again comes out and takes it. Makes such a they must, especially for a defender as well. When you've got a strong keeper who's going to be confident and come out and take it. It's a good ball in as well. Oh, it's just Keeley somehow managed to get a hand to it. It's going to be another corner, though, for Dagger Redbridge. Corner for the Daggers. Oh, and Josh Keeley comes out. Confident goalkeeper, and look at it, what it means to the Barnet players. They know that's probably done enough to seal the three points. And I've got an absolutely delighted Danny Collins next to me.